but mo wa ni school mo je yoko to je pe oju mi mi ori na dada ti ma lo si waju board lati pe mo fe lo ko se o ma fi mi se yeye o de ma fa itiju fun mi lati pe ma ma wo pe ti ma ku lo se yeye won tun to se yeye ni o wa ni lo awon nkan ti ba ti ri ti ba ri ko na ni ma ko o wa je nkan to je ki school tete sun mi ti mi o fi te si waju ni pa school lati pe mo mo lo si school when you play with your mates yeah no 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 you're not supposed to be a part of it so i want to ask me a question that like, what do you think about getting kidnapped and using you for money ritual today there have been about 700 cases of attacks reported in 28 countries these are reported cases alone. Uh, civil society and myself believe that there are far more cases that have not been reported. The majority of victims are children. Unfortunately, there was an attack on a young boy called Mwigulu. Mwigulu is a Tanzanian child with albinism who was attacked in 2013, uh, where his arm was hacked off and stolen and taken away, um, never to be seen. <laughs> Nikundu haka nifunika usoni Nika Nika chokona Hafu Haka nikata mmoja mkono Chosa Walipo marezo haka kimbia Being an albino I've had many experiences of discriminations over It's almost every day I remember when I was working as a, uh, when I was working as an attendant, I was trying to tell my boss that, sir, uh, as a person with albinism, I can't be in the sun. But he was like, no, I don't care. So far, I'm paying you. You have to do anything I tell you. Technically, uh, with the help of my twin brother as well, because he has been there for me from day one. People would discriminate against me on the roadside everywhere, and, and anywhere we go. He's always trying to pick a fight. Like, oh, why would you? discriminate against my brother so even at times people walk to us and try pointing fingers and at us and asking can you see this how many is this can you see this showing your loss so it has not been easy i used to think i was the only one because of the way people were treating me making you feel when you're playing with your mates yeah no 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 no, no. you're not supposed to be a part of it, something like that you have feel, feel left out among your peers those years, I remember uh, in school, those years when we were about having this uh, dancing uh, uh, and cultural, cultural dance. dances in school. No, she's not like us. She should just leave. She's just leave. She doesn't do it well. Think about it. It can be, there's nothing. It can push you to depression. It can make you go insane. When I finished secondary school, I noticed I had something in me, and that thing I had was, I loved music. So I noticed I, I really loved singing. From my singing, when those, my friends were pushing me out, I go to my closet, even in my tertiary institution, I go to my closet, I developed my steps, and to the glory of God, I became one of the best choreographers that could ever be mentioned, and at least I'm sure that a lot of schools have made impact in the life of kids because I love children. Remember, I think more that, but tomorrow we go. Ah, in your no, let me know. Momo it is you, mo party, mo focus on what you are keen to do. She, last time mo fair koshe, mo koko koshe a shorti ta. Where you buy it? Mo pada ti lo ko a mo share me. Preparing persons with albinism as OSHA is just a tradition uh, mentality which it doesn't really, in fact, it doesn't exist. It's just a myth. If you call me OSHA, I used to get angry and tell you I'm not Osha, I'm normal human being. Until when I met one grandfather, he's an elderly man, who, the Baba is in his 80s. He's the one that sat me down and taught me the meaning of that Osha. 
It means Eniti Ori Shayon. It's longer than that, the way the Baba said, but it's as if you were you were specially dedicated to be a dog. And when they say Afi, Afi is not, it's a short form of Afini, something that is white without blemish. When I give birth to my daughter, the first daughter, I don't see that my husband family was happy and my family is looking at what happened. Why is he born happy? No, how come? I don't understand, my family doesn't understand that they, they are telling me that they have Avino in their family. That is why they are happy. Albinism is not a disease. Albinism is a continental disorder caused by the reduced or the complete absence of melanin, the pigment responsible for giving color to the hair, hair and the skin. Albinism is also known as hyperpigmentation. Albinism is challenging to a level. But when you have the love of your parents or your guardian, it goes a long way to boost your morale because you'll be able to face the outside community with that confidence. But a home where persons with albinism have been segregated, they cook their food apart. Me, I've grown all my life eating salt. I've been eating what they eat in my family. I've never eaten any separate meal. When it is time for me to go to secondary school, I was not scared. I was thrown into a body house in a, in a place I've never been, outside Lagos in Ogu State. And that really helped me. Because as young as 10, 11 years, you are put on a stage to face about 500 or more crowd. And you have to sing, you have to dance. I remember vividly, my song, Mudan Pogedepe by Shegu Bokno. That was the rainy song then. It's years, years back. I'm talking about 1973. So, and that gave me a lot of confidence. If I can face such crowd, and people were shouting, ah, I feel you, come on, come on, me, yo, come on, tell you. But because my supposed um, school mother, because immediately you go to school, they will assign you to a senior, has really, she has warned me that I should not feel gentle. I should just go ahead with my song and dance like a Lagos girl that I am. So I really dance. I was there. Being an albino is challenging, but at the same time, it's interesting. It's the way you see it. I love this family so much. I love them. I want the society to try as much as possible to accept us. Because we, are, we have different colors, does not mean we are not human. We are human beings like you. I've seen a child that if the mother wants to punish the child, an albino, he gives her words to go and hug under the hot sun. That's wickedness to me. I, I saw a situation that a woman gave birth and both of them were albinos and she was, they were twins. Children were being offered and sacrificed. Why? We are who we are and we are proud of who we are. God gave us the skin. We are lively. We are social. We are just like every other human. The, the only difference is that we are not dark, we are not colored, but just as white as you see it. If you love yourself first, you would block out any form of discrimination coming out from other people outside. Mm. 
and before you know it you're gonna find yourself you're gonna find someone who loves you you're gonna find someone who wants to have you as anything you are good at a fashion designer a musician you're gonna find that someone out there that doesn't see your albinism that doesn't see you being an albino he sees what you can offer to the table happy international albinism awareness day